Another great interview segment from the Racing Insider Show. But I think it seems to be what side of the fence that you're on. Are you on the side of the fence of the guys who are a little bit off right now? Is it motor? Is it balance of performance? Is, you know, who knows? But what I do know is that a BMW and a Ferrari won at Indy, and we're going ALMS racing through a consolidation next year. You do the math. Bill? You're absolutely right, Jim. There are two sides to this coin, and we'll look at the other side right now with Brian Sellers. He runs an ALMS GT with Falcon Tire. They've got the ability to win. They've got a viewpoint. Let's hear it. Brian Sellers, you've won the last two rounds in Continental Tire. Let's jump over to the ALMS a bit and tell me a little bit about the ALMS GT rules. I hear they're crossing over into United Sports Car kind of intact. And I think that that was probably um, one of the best decisions that they could have made as a unified series. I think that when you look at um, what ALMS has going for it, one of the things that it has uh, in very strong fan following for is the GT series and its current spec. And I think to mess with that GT series would take away some of the prestige of it. Um, but I think exactly. it also shows more than that. It also shows that the ACO is interested in our series, um, which then means that, you know, we will have an involvement, a continued involvement with Lama, which they've already announced. And I think that that brings um, attention to U.S. racing. And I think that that's a great thing. Uh, if they were to go away from that, I think that, that would diminish some of uh, that relationship. And I think it'd be a bad thing for us in general. So I'm all for them leaving um, the American Le Mans Series GT class the way it is moving forward. So um, on that front, I think it's, it's great. It's good to see you at the front of the line. It, in ALMS, you win once or twice a year, but tell me the difference between ALMS and Continental Tire, besides the obvious, you're in high-tech Porsche versus a production-based BMW. Well, believe it or not, there's a lot more similarities and there is differences between the two theories. And I would say some of those things just are basically the competition level of the two and the level of the teams involved in both series. Um, anytime you win a race, it's difficult. And especially, I would say, in ALMS and especially in Continental Challenge, um, the competition level is so deep that on any given day you have easily 10 to 12 cars that can win. So to hit those races correctly and to be able to win those races, you have to make sure you're on point the entire time. You have to have the pit stops uh, right, you have to have good strategy, and then of course as drivers we have to be on our A game because if we're not, someone else will be. Are you on a roll right now? Is the team on a roll? Or you just manage the cards are coming up right and you're hitting every time? I think it's both. I mean, I'm a big believer in momentum. And I like to think that once you get things rolling your way and you get the confidence of everyone coming together, it's hard to slow uh, that combination down. But I also think the cards have fallen in our favor a little bit, for sure. We've been strong for the past two years. We've led a lot of sessions. We've been fastest in a lot of races, and we finished on the podium a couple times. We just haven't been able to get it to all click. And these last two races are what we should have seen more of in the last couple years, you know, just everything kind of coming together when it needed to. So um, I don't want to say it's all luck because there's a lot of preparation and a lot of commitment that goes into to, to the Fall Line Motorsports program. Um, but everybody knows in racing you certainly need luck and preparation to go your way. Brian Sellers, it's great to talk to you again, a fellow Buckeye. Once a Buckeye, always a Buckeye. I love that. Winner of the last two rounds of the Canadian the Continental Tire Sports Car Challenge and with Fall Line Motorsports and uh, runs with Falcon Tire in the ALMS. It's good to talk to you again, partner. You too. The Racing Insiders on MAV-TV every Thursday at 2 and 5 o'clock Eastern and again on Saturdays at 1230 midday.